ठीक है ना अभी रेडियो में सो योर नेम इज माय नेम इज इंक्लूडिंग So, you are from degree, right? Yes, sir. Okay. So, why are you interested in software job? Because you have to more growth to develop my career to be the opportunity. And why did you select Java? Because it is mostly popular language to can develop any application on this processor developer. So I can do Java developer. Okay. All right. So nice. So let us discuss some technical questions on Java. Yes, sir. So what are the access modifiers which are there? Access modifier are uh, four types: public, protect, default, and private. Okay. What is meant by thread? Thread is uh, thread is the class is divided in two types: the thread, the exception, the exception of the thread class, and implementation of the Runnable interface. Okay. So, what is the use of sleep method? Sleep method you can use it to some particular time to wait the thread to execute it. And uh, what is synchronization? Synchronization means you can use it to multiple tasks. Is the end of the synchronization use it to one. Person to wait the process, another person do the process. Okay, alright. Okay, fine. So, what is the use of static keyword? Static keyword is you use it to use static keyword is you use it to perform the. memory management okay. so you told for access modifiers no private public yes, can you explain it to be more detailed yes sir public can access in class subclass and packages also and uh, protected can also access in uh, class subclass and uh, packages and default can only access the class and uh, subclass only private can only access in class Suppose there is one method which is declared as default. Can we access that method? Can we call that method outside the package? Mm. Default method. Mm. I think. Uh, default. So you can access only pack inside the package only, no? Yes. So what is the difference between string and string buffer? String means is immutable. String is immutable, and uh, string you can uh, store it in heap area, mm. SCP area. String memory you can store it in SCP area. String buffer can store it in heap area, and string also string is a Thread or non-thread environment and string buffer is a string uh, multiple thread environment. Okay. What is string builder? String builder is also known as uh, immutable, and it uh, only access the one thread uh, environment, and it can faster than the string buffer to process. Okay. And also it can store the heap area only memory. How many types of exceptions are there? Two types: checked and unchecked. What is the difference? Checked means you can uh, run run time. Sorry, sir. Checked means uh, compare time, and unchecked means run time. Okay. Can you give examples of thread exceptions? Thread exceptions, sir. Yeah. Mm. 
10 exceptions, 10 exceptions, check it means uh, SQL exception is what kind of exception? Check or unchecked? SQL sir. SQL means uh, come. Yeah. Unchecked. Come. Come by time. Come by time. Come by time. Come by time. And uh, IO exception? Come by time, run time. IO exception? IO exception is uh, unchecked. Also so tell me the difference between abstraction and encapsulation. Abstraction is known as uh, either uh, abstraction is the uh, hiding hiding the internal data and uh, hiding the set of services only uh, like the ADM machine. And uh, encapsulation means you can you can minimize the data and code in a single unit. It is uh, and uh, encapsulation known as uh, Safety also. Okay. Abstraction so, also safety. It's both are useful to secure our data. Which one is secured our data? Abstraction and encapsulation. Encapsulation mostly. Then uh, abstraction what security? It's security our uh, passwords, our uh, in, uh, information. So, so like something like code. Code, code security. Yes, code security. Like that. All right, good, fine. So I just want to give feedback to you. So you're doing well. Okay. okay. So there are a few things uh, which still on technical things you have to improve a little bit. Otherwise, you're doing well. Okay. Thank you. All the best. Thank you.